Well, low-income families and residents in Harris County may soon be eligible for a monthly $500 check through the county's newest pilot program. Uplift Harris is a guaranteed income program aimed at helping those most in need, and it's set to launch on Friday. KPRC2's Bill Barajas is live in Southwest Houston with the requirements to apply. Bill. Well, that monthly $500 check will come with no strings attached, but you do have to be 18 years or older, and you have to live in one of 10 high poverty zip uh, zones or zip codes identified by the pilot program, one of which is right here in Golfton in Southwest Houston. However, because this is a federally funded program, undocumented residents will not be eligible. The program's requirements and eligibility came up in commissioner's court on Tuesday. Is employment uh, existing a, a current employment, is that one of the uh, criteria? No, it's not. Will it include undocumented uh, folks? Currently, it does not. The program does not. The program, which was announced and passed in 2023, will provide $500 checks for 18 months. It's being paid for by the American Rescue Plan and is specific as to who it will help. Unfortunately, we won't be able to, because this program is with federal funds, we won't be able to offer this program to the undocumented population. Here's a map showing the zip codes able to apply. They include areas like Acres Home, Sunnyside, and Galena Park. You not only have to live in that area, but families or residents have to be living 200% below the federal poverty line. For a family of four, that's 60,000. For a single person, that's about 29,000. Undocumented residents are not eligible. For us, it's unfortunate that, that people who live in fully undocumented households are not gonna be able to receive this money. Uh, we would have liked to see that differently. Cesar Espinosa, the executive director of Fiel, an immigrant-led civil rights organization, says there's still ways to get help, though. But what we what we are hopeful about is that they are there is ways that people can apply for it if they live in mixed status households. Uh, the problem is is that there hasn't been uh, outreach done at least to this community. And an example of a mixed status household is when, say, the parents are undocumented, but the children or other household members do have U.S. Uh, citizenship. They could then apply on behalf of the family if they meet all the other criteria. Again, the application process is set to launch on uh, Friday, and then we're told you will be notified about one month after if you are accepted into the program. We're live in Southwest Houston. Bill Barajas, KPRC 2 News. All right.